I may have just had one of those moments where I actually forgot I was streaming. <laughs> I was just, we're four minutes into the stream. And I haven't even, like, oh, Jesus. Oh, man. That's gas, though. Like, legit, I, like, I was doing something, and then I got distracted by a clip. Or a few clips, I think it was. And, yeah, now I'm here. Hey, Justin, how's it going? Oh. Oh, that's just Bethesda, okay. Just give it a second. We just need to get past all the loud stuff. Okay, now we're past it. I just want to put this in the chat as well, just real quick. Manually unpin at the end. There we go. Right, ready to go. Um, yeah, I actually need to just stop for a minute and just explain what's been happening, Jesus, because, like, a lot has actually happened. So, as I already mentioned the glasses, uh, I literally see the prime thing here, like, I went to, um, I went to see the KS, uh, KSI fight in Manchester. As I, like, said to myself, like, the atmosphere is really good, it, like, when you're in that kind of, like, hive mind moment, and you just let yourself be absorbed by it. Like, you say some things, like... Literally when, like, Alex Wasabi was, like, out, I was like, pussy -o! And I was just shouting it out loud. And, uh... Oh, what was I saying as well? When fucking... Logan Paul was walking out in the, like, trip, or, uh, during the fight, or... The walk-in for the fight. Like, I literally screamed, I want my crypto zoo egg back! And, uh, what was it? For Dylan, I was like, I want my money back! Crazy things you say like when you're in that like environment And even like it's so weird to me as well to think I wanted both of them to just beat the shit out of each other I didn't care who won but for I, I literally just because Dylan was being a fucking dickhead I actually wanted Logan to win and I'm glad he did win even though it looks like they're trying to make him uh, like lose for From uh, disqualification or some shit like that cuz he whatchamacallit um like, one of his security guards came in a bit too early during the uh, fight or some shit. And that might be an actual problem for them, so, yeah. Uh, the only thing, I, the only reason I mentioned a prime yoke, by the way, is because um, I have this, like, armband. Like, if you ever see any clips of the fight, look in the background and see all those lights. If it's not just, like, white lights, like, camera flashes, they're literally, like, the armbands that everybody was wearing uh, with prime on it. That, like, glowed, like, different colors and changed a lot, like... It's pretty cool, like, because, like, the first time it happened, I just saw, like, a glow, like, everyone started to glow, and I looked at my wrist, I was like, what the fuck, my wrist is glowing. <laughs> oh, and that was another weird thing as well that happened when I was on the trip. W there was one moment, I legit just, like, I was at the hotel, no, we were going to the hotel, and I just felt my fist, or fist, my wrist vibrate, even though I didn't bring my Fitbit with me. I was like, wait, why do, what the, what, why did my wrist do that? And, of course, my hand was freaking out because I left my ring at home because, like, I didn't want to lose the ring. I wanted to make sure to keep it with me, so. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, overall, uh, just quick words in the fight before I actually get into the game. Um, I have to say it was pretty shit, honestly, overall. <laughs> like, there was a few good moments in, I think, nearly all the fights. But for the most part, like... The literal, like, actual, like, substance in the show was, like, the middle of it. Like, the second uh, round of fights. Like, so we had, like, I think it was, like, the undercard or something. Then we have <coughs> another, the next card after that, and then the main event. Like, legitimately, the fucking middle one, three good fights. The tag team one was fucking brilliant. Uh, there was another one, I think, literally in the middle of it. It was, like, round the third fight of five. That was one I think was good as well. And then the last one, I think it was Slim versus Salt Pappy. I think that's the names. I might be getting them wrong. That was good as well. There's something about those where it's just like, they they actually were like, ooh. And there was, oh man, you have to check out my Twitter as well. After like the fucking, um, what's we call it? After like uh, the fight, 
Penenes, like he was in the tag team against Alex Wasabi. He goes up to him and Alex is like, like trying to chill with him, not knowing what like Penenes is going to do. Like, he's like, oh, we're chill and all that. And then Penenes just speaks in like, I can't, I don't remember what language he's actually speaking and I don't want to just assume it. Um, but he says something in a different language and Alex is like, oh, yeah, we're cool, uh, Mikasa or something like that. I can't remember what exactly he said. Like, basically, he just was assuming he meant to be chill. But I meant to actually look around to see if anybody translated what, like, Penena said. Because it probably was something. It was definitely something about Alex, anyway. Because he mentioned Alex's name in the sentence. So, yeah. I gotta stop rubbing my eyes. It's actually irritating my eyes. <coughs> um, I did see uh, new Prime bottles. As everyone knows, I'm a prime enthusiast i'm actually um i don't i don't even know why i'm just addicted to trying to find them and taste them um i actually saw glowberry and actually the blueberry dodgers prime that you can only get in la but like we did not walk into the shop we knew for a fact if we walked into that shop easily would have asked for a shit ton of pounds for those bottles and i was like nah i'm good and like, funny enough, we actually went into other shops that would have actually had Glowberry, but they just did not have Glowberry, unless they just sold out of them. And to be fair, though, we are going, like, in the middle of the day, like, well, not even the middle of the day, like, past the middle of the day. So, like, the likelihood of us actually finding, like, those primes in particular, or, like, at least Glowberry is, like, very low. But there wasn't even, like, I think there was orange. But, like, oh, yeah, no, I did buy an orange can because it was only £2, like... And I did the little bit of maths, like roughly two fifty euro. So like, that that's cheaper than what I can get here. For here, it's like, actually, yeah, no, no, like here in Ireland, it's like three to four euro for a can. So, I mean, half the price. Why not? Like, and plus, I I was getting a bit tired, so I needed energy, and I was like, oh yeah, I'll get the orange can. I, to be fair, I think the orange one was. Oh no, actually, no, there was others in the. I think it was Poundland we went into. It's basically. Poundland is what Deals is, is in, in Ireland. It's like a like cheap shop kind of thing. Um, my voice was hoarse afterwards. I can't, I'm kind of feeling it now again. <clears throat> because this most I've talked all day. Um, other than that, I'll go back to the Prime for a second. I was actually looking at the Prime website. I, I'm so sad. I've actually written, <laughs> written this down. Like um, how like many different Prime bottles are missing. Uh, we went for like... We left Saturday morning, and we came back yesterday afternoon. So, yeah. I, I was pretty fucking busy. Like, after the last stream, like, I had lots of things to do. I had to get the glasses, and then I did the stream there, so there's that. Um, the next day, actually, I think I was just chilling. Because I just, I knew I had to chill, and then I was looking for bits that I needed to bring with me. Saturday, we got up like two o'clock in the morning and we were actually like, we actually did go to the hotel early. And of course they said like, um, we can't guarantee we can get you in now, but like, you know, we'll try and fair play to them because like we, we were like, oh yeah, no, we, we, we want to visit some places anyway, because uh, my mate wanted to bring me to a Greg's, which was the best fucking idea. And we also went to a, um, a shop nearby. I can't remember what it was though. It was in a garage, and like again, of course, looking for Prime there and wasn't there. Uh, but Greg's was fantastic. Like Greg's was so good that I went for round two. Well, essentially, just I had like basically a main course, and then I also had like dessert as well. Uh, even though it's, they don't really serve that kind of food, but like it's good hot food though. And um, it was really quiet because of the positioning of it. Like it was actually one of those Greg's that are kind of like out of the way. So we could get in. But we did see other Greggs around. Like when we were in Manchester City itself. And bro, they were so busy. Like every single shop. Like food shop especially were so busy. We were fucking starving after the fight. And we just had to go straight to the hotel. Because we could not go in anywhere. Like there was too many people like. Um, whatchamacallit. Like I, in Greggs I had. I got two portions of. Um. Like chip popcorn chicken that were like a bit spicy, which was nice. Uh, these there was these birds as well that just kept like looking for food off us. So I like anytime I finished my like 
bits I just like threw the crumbs I like, got to the ground for them to eat like but they those birds were pure like scrapping each other for the food like they're per, pure just like pecking each other like uh my mate gave me a bit of his um sausage roll as well because that's what you go to Greg's for a sausage roll so <laughs> I should have just got a sausage roll myself because it was like the little piece I had was fucking banging man oh like like literally when I go to like anywhere that has a Greg's I am going to Greg's for the sausage roll next time like a full one uh, and then he gave me, like, there's these, like, glazed pastries. They're, like, nearly glazed donuts. Those were pretty good as well. And there's, what else? I got another thing for myself. I'm trying to remember what it was. Like, there's something else in the thing. I can't remember. But for dessert, I got, like, God, what did I get again? I can't remember. All I remember is that it was good. I think that's all that matters anyway. Um... Yeah, so we didn't, so like for the first day we were flat out because like we were flying over and we were also going to the fight that night as well. So like once we were done going to the shop and to Greg's, went back to the hotel, waited probably like five minutes and then my mate was told, oh yeah, by the way, yeah, we got your guys' room ready. Even though like it was probably like 12 o'clock and they couldn't really, like they're not meant to sign us in until two, but they actually managed to get the room ready by two, so that's good. And when we went to the room as well, my mate like requested two beds if possible, and we were luckily enough, were like lucky enough to actually get two beds. But bro, I fucking sunk in the bed like, oh my god, like it was actually so like um, like the bed actually absorbed you like, and the pillows were nice as well because they were firm. I actually do prefer firmer pillows than uh, very wavery pillows, uh, very soft and well, not even squishy, but like. You know, you like your head mold would go into it, and it just keeps it like memory foam, but like not thing. Um. So yeah, we went into there. I think we wait. Yeah, we waited like probably an hour and a half or so, and then we went to, what's we call it? Yeah, we went to the city center, and we messed around for a bit until we could get in. Uh, we got what was the food we got? We got um, Pizza Hut. I think it was. Yeah, no, we got, like, pizza. We got, like, small pizza. We got some bits. I, I know there was some chips. But I can't remember what else we got. And for some reason, I just got a fruit shoe. I should have just got an actual proper cup of, like, uh, soda. Or, sorry. Um, I shouldn't be insulting the, the American. That's literally in chat right now. Um, but um, we got, like, a... Or I should have got a fizzy drink. There we go. That's what I was going to say. Um... But, whatchamacallit, <laughs> come on, Joe, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, there's no need to correct it, I insulted you, you you're, like, right to lash out at me. Um, don't make fun of us Americans, I apologise. <laughs> to be fair, when we were over there, we were doing the British accent so much, I had to say to my mate, we should probably just be careful. Like, it's fine for me, because I'm actually British, like, I can make fun of myself, but, like, if other people, like... Saw my Italian friend making fun of, like, British people, like, doing the accent stuff. Like, <laughs> I don't know how well that would have gone down. Um, yeah, we weren't actually that far away from the arena. We were, like, five-minute walk away because we dropped basically near the place. And then we went to the arena. And, of course, for the whole time, when we were getting to the plane, I was shitting myself. When we were on the plane, actually, to be fair, when we were on the plane, it wasn't that bad. When we were getting to the hotel, it wasn't that bad either. To be, you know, actually, you know what? You want to know what's a crazy thing? We actually walked from the fucking airport to our hotel. Like, that's how close our hotel was to the airport. We literally were just like, huh, like 40 minute walk, you know, just fuck it. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> it saved us taking a taxi, so why not? And it gave us like a cool kind of moment, like where we were walking and we're like, this kind of feels like Ireland, but it isn't Ireland. It's like all the signs are just English and there's no Irish on them, like, which was, like, strange. And, like, actually seeing, like, a motorway sign with, like, the words Leeds written on it, it's just mad, like, because that's where I was born, like, I was born, like, in uh, Leeds, like, Yorkshire. Um, whatchamacallit, uh, hotel there. But, yeah, no, like, once we were in, it was actually, it was pretty sound. I didn't drink much. I only had like um one like pint. 
even though they were literally selling cups that could hold two points, or what I probably should have been calling them, like, American, like, pints, because, like, those cups were big. Like, they were huge. Like, and that's not an insult, by the way. That's actually just, you know, because, like, your portion sizes are legitimately bigger. I've been to America. Like, I I know what they're like, um, compared to Ireland, obviously, as well. Um, yeah, when we were there, like... The atmosphere was nice. Uh, obviously, there wasn't a lot of people in the venue yet because I think a lot of people know that like the main event doesn't really start until like well, basically the end of the event. But we were in there for like I think we were in probably before five o'clock, and it finished like probably around twelve fifteen midnight. So yeah, we have big of a lot of things. Unfortunately, it's not what you're packing downstairs, but everything else is bigger, so that's a plus, you know. That's a W. Um, <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so we were there. We got thing. Uh, I will say, as I already mentioned, what the fights were like. I was so distraught. If I had already shown my face, I would actually show you my actual reaction to fucking the words Tommy Fury being shouted as, like, he cheered. Like, my face of disbelief. I was legitimately so depressed that night. Not even just that, like, when we left as well, we forgot to, like, I think there was, there was, like, if you gave back your armband to the event, you would actually get, like, a Prime card bottle of Prime, and that's probably the only Prime bottle that I would actually hold on to. I'd drink the Prime, but I'd hold on to the bottle, because they would, literally will never print those bottles ever again. I will pull a Wakey Wines and sell it for a hundred pounds. <laughs> No, nah, no, nah, I'd probably keep it for myself and then go from there. Actually, I didn't even mention as well, because I literally threw the t-shirt in the wash as well. Um, But they actually gave us, like... Now, of course, for £170 for a ticket, and you get, like, a closer seat to the ring, you'd hope you get something. But everyone in the arena actually got, like, not just the wristband, but they also got, like, an exclusive, like, Prime shirt as well, so it has Prime on the front, and then it has, like, the Prime card details on the back of it, which is pretty cool. Because I don't actually have a lot of shirts that have detail on the back. And uh, I also got a hat as well that says Prime and the Prime card on the back. And it's the first time I've got like a hat that's like a bit netty in the back, like a net. Like, you know, it's more open than like trying to close and hide my hair. Like, I think it's kind of nicer for the summertime to have a hat like that. I really hope I don't lose those kind of things. Like, because like those are like legitimately things you'll never get again. But... They're really cool. I hope the sh shirt doesn't fade fast as well. But if it does, it does, you know. I gotta remember, though, when it's washed, like, to actually take a picture with both the shirt and the hat on, like. Like, I want to do that thing where I, the models, like, they turn around and they use their thumbs and point at their back, like. Because, like, I think that'd just be a cool shot, like. And there's also a shot of me, like, squatting, like, um, a Slavic, um, a Gopnik, that's it. Uh, <laughs> but, again, I can't really show that because that shows my face. Yeah, I was also, like, um, wearing, like, a leather jacket as well. It was, like, my dad's jacket, and, like, it fit me well, and, like, I love that the weather, for the most part, was actually holding up well. Like, whenever it rained, we weren't really in the rain for too long, and it only rained for, like, a few minutes at a time anyway, like, twice, so, yeah. What should I get for mouse and keyboard for a gaming setup? Um, I don't honestly know for the keyboard, because, like, me, I literally just have a trust keyboard that I bought in the shop nearby. And it does me well because literally just hear that. It's a mechanical keyboard, my favorite keyboard. I have a membrane one as well, but it's smaller. And like, I don't really think I like using that kind of like keyboard for uh, gaming. Or at least I haven't been forcing myself to use it for gaming yet. That's why I have this. And I actually got this for the Xbox when I still had it. Oh, excuse me. But as for a mouse, I don't know what kind is better, but my mouse is literally like, what, 20 euros. So that's like roughly $20. I don't know the branding of it. Uh, it's iMice, I think I said. Yeah, iMice Gaming Mouse. And it's literally just, it's a, as I said, it's a 20 euro uh, mouse, like pretty cheap, but like it's got the side buttons uh, it's got, like, the, uh, DPI yoke in the middle, so you can adjust how fast your mouse goes in real time. And it's very aerodynamic. Like, it's, again, very cheap, but, like, it does me well, like. And it has, like, a little, like, uh, finger and thumb rest on the sides, like. So, 
for me i that's my mouse recommendation for the keyboard i don't know it's up to you like if you want a glowing keyboard they go for it like a chroma one uh, but my one literally doesn't glow because I don't actually like, um, I, I never liked when my old mouth glowed or glue because like it actually would shine directly into my eyes because like it was um, like the way, it was just str a strong light inside. I still have the old one here, but it doesn't work anymore and I can't unplug it yet because I want I don't want to take all the wiring apart and redo it and basically fix my wiring. So yeah, uh, does it have RGB? The mouse, yeah. But the keyboard, no. I can actually... Hold on. <clears throat> Why you gotta get me down like that? Oh, down like that. Oh, wow. I still can't believe that fucking fight, though, between Logan and Dylan Dennis. That was actual horseshit. Like, I wish I could have actually gotten partial refund on that, like, whole card, man. They should have only charged me, like, a quarter of the price for that event, man. That was... That was just... Oh. Um, what was I mentioning? Oh, yeah, I was mentioning. Oh, yeah, so after the fight, um, hold on, actually, let me just close this for a minute. Just make sure everything's cool. Oh, I know we haven't even started the game yet, but I, I want to talk. It's been a while since I talked. Yeah, here we go. We got the IRL cam. So, this is my mouse here. See it? It's like all glowy and stuff. Uh, I would turn it around, but I don't know. Does it reflect? Not really, but it might like, uh, Shine in your eye if you're not careful there. Eh, see it there, eye mice. I don't know how, like, thing it is, but yeah, like, as you can see on the inside, like, it's very, like, um, holy. Like, you, it's very aerodynamic and all that shit. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's what it's called, eye mice, yeah. Never heard of them. It's because it's, like, an off-brand kind of mouse, honestly. I think that's why. <clears throat> and then this is my keyboard. My, uh, crusty, dusty-ass keyboard. It does the job, honestly. <laughs> but you can tell here, like, I, I, you can tell I'm a gamer here, like, and uh, I also got these buttons missing as well. That's control, that's left shift, W, S, D, uh, Z, or Z, and C. <laughs> Bruh. Yeah. Um, oh, shit, where, why did I drag that down here? Hold on. There we go, that's better. Right. Um... Is that, uh, is that one you smashed? No, I don't think I've smashed it before. Because if I did, I probably would have to buy a new one. But, uh, unironically... Wait, is this? Okay, that's this one. Um, unironically, though, if I did smash my keyboard, I would literally get the exact same keyboard again. Because the shop that I got it from before, which, of course, I'm not going to disclose uh, where I got it, but the shop that I got it before um, literally has the exact same keyboard in the exact same box. On the shelf. So, like, I literally, I, I'm ready. Like, whenever it actually kaputs, I'm like, yep, cool, time to get a new one. Uh, or actually, yeah, no, I'd probably still get a new one. I don't think I want to use, because I do have a spare HP one for when I got an all-in-one computer. I used to use that a little bit, and I actually recorded, I think, like, the Minecraft series on that and all. But, like, yeah. Um... And as I said, like, I don't really care for the RGB kind of stuff, honestly. It's just meh. I don't know. Just rage on your keyboard. I probably should give myself an excuse to buy a new keyboard, but I don't know. I'm just saving my money. Like, why not? Like, I do have the money. Like, I could if I really wanted to splurge, but... Eh. I don't know, Doc. I don't know. Um, Whatchamacallit. Yeah, sorry. Uh, Fight... After fight, depressed uh, because it was cold. The Uber was legitimately stuck in traffic right in front of our face, so they couldn't actually stop and let us in yet uh, because we had to wait until they could actually come to us. Uh, and I just remember, like, I think it was it the morning or the night. I think it was the morning. Yeah, it was the morning I did it because it was too like very. We were both tired and we like we did buy stuff from the shop, so we had something to eat, but it wasn't a lot. At least breakfast was free, so when we woke up, we could eat that. Um, yeah, I was so depressed because, like, as we were walking away from the venue, like, basically waiting for the Uber, you could see other people with, like, the prime card bottles. And, like, actually, let me just pull it up on the screen real quick. I'm going to just, like, show you the bottle. Like, I know it's not much, and it's probably just the same flavors as the other, but, like, uh, 
Yeah, prime. Out. Bottle. Is this gonna work? Nope, redirect notice. Hold on. I am jealous. I was so depressed. I wanted to fucking cry, man. Like, I I thought those bottles weren't obtainable, but like they were. And like you have to remember, right? I spent a hundred and seventy pound for each ticket. So the least they could do is actually give us the thing as well, like. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, Wakey Wines, of course. Did they get the pro if they got the card bottles, man, I swear. Um yeah, there we go. It should work now. Oh god. Wait, hold on. See, these are the bottles here, right? And like, sure, they don't look like much. <laughs> yeah, you got robbed. We got robbed not just from the fight, but the fact that we didn't get these fucking bottles either. Again, the bottles, again, were probably just, um... I'd assume one of them was probably, like, KSI flavor, and maybe the other one's, like, just fruit punch. But again, man, still look! Let me stone and... Ah! Sorry. Right, anyway. That was what I was doing in, like, the morning. I was literally just screaming into the bed, like, random shit, like, and my mate was just laughing at me for it, because it was funny. Um, whatchamacallit. Whatchamacallit. Uh, it was the duck. <laughs> what the dog doing? I know, the, uh, I don't have dog. Actually, I do. His name is Floppy, but he's still in the storage box. He, he's not getting out of there. I actually, like, sent a message before to someone and it was literally taking this picture of my storage box because I was working with them again and rearranging shit. I, I literally have a storage box to store my fucking anime figure boxes. And it's just two of them. Part of me, like, I really want to get rid of them, but I don't at the same time. Like, maybe if I take a picture of the Hanukkah figure, because I think that's rare. They don't do them anymore. Maybe somebody might want it. But it is kind of broken because the hair can kind of slip out anytime. Anyway. Um, yeah, we woke up the next morning, had breakfast, kind of just chilled in the hotel room. And then we went to the hotel, went home. Um, actually, no. Well, I say went home. My mate went home. I went because um, my mom and my brother were like out eating. So I went to meet them. And uh, yeah, then we came home and then that's it. That's the whole trip. Like. Fake prime bottle. Oh, you know, people were pointing that out to be fake, but it was actually just two different prime bottles. Like, that's gas. Then you were here. Yep, now I'm here. Literally, uh, took obviously that day off. Uh, had good sleep last night. Decent enough, anyway. Uh, except I will admit the fucking mornings are just um, like so cold. But, um, whatchamacallit, went through today, put up some smoke alarms, uh, and then streamed. And now we have, like, probably, like, over half an hour left of time, but that's fine. Uh, yeah. Other than that, I was going to mention about the Prime bottles. The only ones I'm missing, like, the ones I haven't tried yet, other than the Prime card ones, are... Glowberry, which I think, like, Glowberry is starting to spread out more across the UK, so I'm, I think it'll be in Ireland soon. I do know on the Prime website they officially have Prime listed uh, in Ireland, but they say they only have four flavors, but, like, I know, I remember, because Circle K put out a teaser for Prime. They also have Metamoon, so I don't know why they don't list Metamoon on the official website, but that's there as well. And I know, like, another shop or two... We're doing strawberry, watermelon, and orange. Now, these are shops that aren't meant to have Prime, but, like, have it anyway. So, yeah. If only, like, if more shops in Ireland could officially just be like, yep, we're getting Prime. Um, yeah. What you call that? And there's also, there was a place my mate went to. Uh, oh, what was it called? Well, I'm going to look at my history real quick. Because it's literally a place where you can buy, like, pallets, like, actual like 24 packs of prime for like 23 euro i think it was which is roughly like 25 dollars so like 25 dollars for 24 bottles like is fucking that's a literal steal 
Now, I'm not saying I would... <laughs> I'm not saying I would actually buy a pallet, but I wouldn't even know how to get at home. <laughs> like, um... Hold on, where is it? Where's the search bar? There's the search bar. Uh, let me just look up Prime. Oh, maybe it's because I looked up on my phone. But there's these places in Dublin anywhere where you can get like pallets of them. There's they literally do like pallets of glowberry. So my mate like said he's going to be up in Dublin tomorrow. So I'm actually just <laughs> I'm just like please go to it. Find it if there's the bottles. Because if he messaged me saying they have it here and it's at a decent price, I would actually say to him, yes, please. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Um, so, yeah, sorry. Glowberry, the prime balls, uh, prime card balls haven't tried. I never will because they're just gone now, out of reach. So I don't even, I, I don't even have them listed anymore. Um... Uh, hold on, sorry. Did you get the clothes? Yeah, no, I got the clothes. Like, I literally... I still have them. I have my hat with my hat collection. I have probably seven caps. Three kind of beanie hats. One bucket hat that I got when I was in America. And I feel like there's another hat variant I'm missing. Oh, and then I also have, like, two different types of Christmas beanies. Which... Oh, no, no, they're not beanies. They're, like, woolly hats. And actually, yeah, that, that other hat I mentioned, the third uh, beanie isn't a beanie, it's a woolly hat. Actually, I only have one beanie, and then three woolly hats, and one of them's Christmas. And then the other Christmas one isn't either. Oh, no, yeah, no, wait, one of the Christmas ones is a beanie. Uh, anyway, look, I have a lot of hats, right? We got a prime, like, everyone in the arena got a prime card hat uh, that's orange and black. And I got a Prime shirt that is, like, is orange as well. And it has the Prime card fights on the back of your back. Um, but it only lists, like, KSI versus Tommy, Logan versus Dylan. And I think it was, like, two or three other fights. Because they couldn't obviously fit all the... Well, I mean, they should have fit all the fights on the back, but, eh, whatever. Um, so, yeah, that was, like, the clothing that we got when we were there. My mate literally was like, oh, I'm going to buy this shirt just as memorabilia. But then when we went in, it's like you get a shirt and hat for free. It's like, oh, well, fuck. <laughs> Rip. Mm. Um. Oh, yeah, Prime. Uh, KSI flavor. I didn't actually, like, surprisingly enough, in that shop where I saw Glowberry and uh, the Dodgers Blueberry Prime... I didn't actually see the KSI flavor in there. I, I literally just seen those uh, two and a few others. I might have seen lemonade in there as well, but I don't know. Um, but yeah, the KSI flavor is still elusive to me. And I really want to try that because the KSI flavor is what the orange prime energy can flavor is. It's orange and mango. Yeah, orange and mango, which was actually pretty good. I like the can. Um, I don't know if it's my favorite, though. I think it's my second favorite. And then another one is... Oh, no, yeah, I think it's lemon lime. That's my favorite can, if I remember right. I, I think I did a tier list a, a while ago. I can't remember if I actually even uploaded it, to be honest. But I definitely streamed it. Um, Then there's lemonade. I'm, I'm actually so convinced lemonade is actually just an exclusive in the US. Because I've actually not seen it elsewhere. Other than, like, shops that are overselling it uh, for price. Like, even, like, if I went to the closest shop, like, that sells Lemonade Prime when they probably shouldn't. They're selling it for, like, I think six or seven euro. I'm not paying six or seven euro for a dented bottle as well, by the way. So those collectors out there are definitely not going to buy it. But I'm still not buying it. Alright, three euro or lower. That's it. Like, I'm not spending more... I will never spend more than three euro again on a bottle of Prime. Unless it's like, for whatever reason, a Prime card bottle maybe. That's like three euro fifty. But even then, that's like the highest I ever would pay for a Prime hydration bottle. But I've only ever paid three quid for a Prime bottle. And the highest for cans I've paid is like four euro a can. Even though it actually, you know, four euro a can, three euro is the cheapest at one point. Three fifty. And then there was like... I think it was, um, there was another shop that was doing Prime. 
And they were selling, I think, the bottles and the cans for three quid, which is actually pretty good. Yeah. Um, yeah, lemonade. Probably will never get that. Unless I go back to the US again. But unfortunately, I don't really have much plans to fly to the US. <laughs> but, but if I do, you bet your ass it's going to be LA and we're going to the Dodger Stadium and we're just going <laughs> to look for the Blueberry Prime and the um, Lemonade pr Prime in the same area. Like, Even though for lemonade, you can kind of go anywhere for that. I'd assume, anyway. Because um, I think when I went on the Prime website as well... Actually, I can literally click into it here. I just see it for reference. Um, did I? I did. Um, you, can, you can even hear my voice getting a bit more hoarse. Uh, they have it there. Where was it? Prime Hydration. Oh, no, sorry. Verifier Prime. USA. Oh, yeah, wait. It's not even listed there on the USA. I don't think then it's listed in any other country. It's literally just on the website. But then again, it says find in store. So it's just like, what? I kind of want to like tweet at Prime just to see like if the lemonade one, like, actually I might just do it. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to do that like right now. I'm just going to tweet at Prime. Uh, yo, at Prime Hydration, Hydrate, sorry. Uh, where do the lemonade prime bottles be at? Asking for a stream. There we go. <laughs> I love that you can actually look at that in real time and say, Joe, why did you actually tweet that out, though? Um, I would like to go to Ireland. Yeah, honestly, like, coming here to Ireland would be pretty chill, like, um, especially, like, that'd actually be a cool thing as well, like, if it was you and your sister, even a bit, like, a few more of your family members came over, because, like, it'd be a nice, like, full circle thing for what we, like, did anyway. Now, to be fair on us, uh, unfortunately, we'd have to literally take you on the bus, like, everywhere. Well, actually, uh, no, no, actually, no, we'd be able to drive you, but, like, I can't drive. And, uh, like, Brando can't drive either. So, like, it, it'd be limited time, but we could use the bus anyway. Like, it's pretty cheap. And I think, like, because I have a Leap card, I can actually ask if I can pay with the Leap card for everyone else as well. So, yeah. Yeah, but, like, I don't know if she'd be able to actually drive in Ireland. And I think it's a very expensive, like, to rent a car while you're on holiday. So, unless you want to, like, pay out the ass, like, for a car when you're on holiday, like, it's a bit much, like. So, yeah. Um, the next prime flavor I haven't tried as well is, um, grape. I actually meant to, let, let me just, there we go. Just mark that orange so I don't have to read it again. Or bread. Uh, the grape flavor, I'm pretty sure, yeah, so in the US on here it says it's there. And let me just check the United Kingdom. Yes, the UK also do grape as well. That's pretty epic. That's pretty pog. You know, actually, why don't I just do this? Sorry, um... I know this, yeah. And then let me just hide. Game. There we go. So, like, that one I haven't tried as well, the Prime one. And then Lemonade. Where was it? Yeah, Lemonade is here. Um, Hey, Alex. <laughs> Happy Halloween. Happy early Halloween to you, too. I actually looked at the date and I thought I saw the 30. I'm like, what the fuck? How did 15 days fly by so fast? How are you doing? We're just, I was just discussing a lot about the um, little holiday I was on. And now we're talking about Prime because I couldn't get any new Prime. Um, was it grape? Uh, I mentioned the KSI flavor. See, like, look how cool that bottle is. Okay, never mind. We can't see it because you can't view it on the website. But the KSI was pretty cool, so. Uh, we were talking about how Joe loves me. Ah, yes, exactly. Justin's like my favorite guy. Hold on, I, need, I literally need to open this bottle to take the rest of <clears throat> Do, do, re, mi, fa, so, la, di, do. Oh. Um, I actually had that. It was literally just, I was randomly shopping, and it was just in the shop. I was like, oh, cool, I'll pick this one up. Uh, but this one is literally this, but this also has mango inside. And no other prime flavor has mango. But the can is uh, orange mango, as it says there. 
Um, other than that, yeah, there is no original, but there is. Oh yeah, sorry, sorry. Oh no, it's not. Yeah, there's only original energy. That's the only can I haven't had yet, and these are like new. Oh, why does it do that? Like, I hate when it does that. Like. Actually, wait, hold on, wait. It didn't just... Okay. Oh my god, my fucking heart. I, I thought I was low-key just doxing myself. I thought it was putting the marker directly on where I live and then putting another marker where the closest shop was to me. Oh my god, they gave me a heart attack. Jesus. Okay. <laughs> it's it's cool, it's fine. It was just point. I think it was somewhere in Limerick it was pointing to. Um, Danigan, oh why Ireland? I have no clue where the fuck that is. Like, um, what you call it? Oh yeah, so uh, there's hydrate. That's the original uh can flavor, and then there's the sticks and tubs. The tubs I think are new, so I don't actually know if like, because they don't actually list um, which will I see? They just have hydration sticks. They don't actually have um. Hold on, let me go to the main site itself. There's the cans. There's the can there as well. Oh, excuse me. And there's the sticks. But the thing is, like, I literally... I don't think they have any of those in Ireland yet. Like, not even a shop, like, selling them for a decent price, like. Uh, so, yeah, I just legitimately just never had any of these. Um, I think though the Meta Moon one is like exclusive to Walmart, so I don't think you can actually get that like anywhere else except Walmart in America. So that's like that's another exclusive in another country. I'm not gonna get unless I go to there. Like that's so annoying. So as that, that's the KSI flavor and the Dodgers flavor, the Meta Moon stick. The lemonade, I think I didn't mention that as well. That might be exclusive, maybe online. I don't know, like, because, like, it's just, I haven't, like, seen it in any of these lists here. And that's what I mean, by the way, with Ireland being here as well. This is apparently all we get. Except if you check my channel, you'll know, like, I've drank more than these four. Like, I've seen, even, like, recently, I've seen strawberry ones stocked up quite a bit. I've had the orange one as well. I feel like I've had another one and I can't remember it. Anyway, sorry, enough of my rant. Um, and there's also meant to be, like, prime tubs as well. I'll just see if I can get that picture real quick. Uh, let me just go prime tracker. Right, just making sure I'm not uh, leaking my stuff real quick. So this, this is how bad this has gotten. I'm literally following a fucking Prime Tracker or the Prime Tracker uh, Twitter account. It's unofficial. Um, literally just to see if I can get Prime. Like, look. Ah! He's getting all these bottles. Like, I couldn't see. Like, I saw it, but I couldn't buy it because I just knew I was going to get price gouged. Even though I was on holiday and I was willing to spend that extra bit, I said to myself, nah, we keep walking. We don't stop. Like, look at this! Like, fellas got the Prime Card ones, Glowberry, that's fair, yeah? But then they also have Dodgers. You can't tell me you got that all in the UK when you're, like, that's meant to be an exclusive thing. And, like, you can even tell, actually, between the bottoms of the bottles, like, the like, I think these ones are from the US and these ones are from the UK. See, this is how bad I am with fucking Prime now. I'm actually so demented when it comes to Prime, like, um, that was gas. That was gas as well. I remember that was one of the first images I saw after the fire concluded. That was me and, like, well, actually, it wasn't really me internally. I said I was just kind of depressed and sad, but yeah. This was also fucking gas. <laughs> Can all the boxing judges call us immediately? And it's fucking spec savers, like. Um, what should we call it? Which bro misfits has spent like 20k. Okay, let's see. Guys, if you're going to be here at the AO Arena to watch the prime card, you are going to get. Yeah, see, this is it. These were the hats and shirts you got when you uh, attended the event. So, you know, £170. Probably, like, let me say, like, maybe £20 for the hat and shirt. And then £10 for the actual good fights. 
then the rest is a ripoff. <laughs> like all like me, literally, my friend said afterwards. Okay, if KSI is ever fighting again, I think I'm just going to get the pay for view, which is fair because to do what we did was actually quite a lot. Like, ah, oh, man, I can't get over it. I can't get over it. I love the way, the way you could see that as well, like the different like variants, like. Lucky. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. Just literally hand-delivered as well. And this is why I was going mental, like, not too long ago about Glowberry. Because, like, Sports Direct were getting them. So, like, I knew where I needed to go to to check them out. Uh, Aldi were getting them in. And this is all, like, in the UK as well. Yeah, look at that. And then, like, if you look at all these kind of images, like, none of them really show lemonade or grape anywhere, as far as I'm aware. Oh, Jesus, that's actually a lot. i never even seen that one before. <laughs> Crazy. I know this account, though, is kind of shitting on the bottle designs, but I don't actually mind them. Yeah, see, like, if we... Even just looking at these, like, you don't really see... Like, unless maybe they're sold out, but, like, based on the way they're stacked, like, I don't know. I'm literally just not seeing any lemon or grape there. It just makes me cry, you know. Stop showing me the fucking prime card one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna my monitor's gonna end up like this one up here. <laughs> anyway, sorry, right, right. Um, this one. There you go. Like the right one for a start. Um, oh yeah, sorry. I was meant to show the tubs. I can't remember where that was though. But all I know is I think it wasn't Walmart. It was um. Oh, wait, there's one results. Where is it? <coughs> Excuse me. Where is it? It's literally just not going to it. It's telling me there's, like, a tub result, but, like, there isn't any. And they don't actually list the tubs on their website, so maybe they were just off-brand uh, Prime tubs, but still. Hold on, sorry. I need to get my rant out about all this prime shite. Like, this fella's actually going this age is on about thing, like. Ah, uh, ba ba. Ba da 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 ba ba. Where's, 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 where's. Where's, where's, where's. where's where? There it is. Uh, oh, yes, it's the American uh, brand called Dix. <laughs> that, that's that's the place you're meant to be able to get these um, prime tubs on. Um, uh, do you love lobster now? Have you confessed your love? He, he's my bro, yeah. Not my actual bro, but, like, we, we, we tie it. He's my broski. So, see there. Hold on, actually, give me a sec. Welcome to the bromance between a viewer and his friends' brother. I wouldn't actually even say Brent, friends' brother, just friend. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember that. I need to find where that VOD is and actually take it down. Because, like, with all the stuff that's come about about Jack's films and Sniper Wolf, it's made me a lot more... Uh, conscious to like react content. I know that's literally what I'm doing right now, but like I think scrolling Twitter is different than fucking playing a video and letting it play out. Like I just feel like I don't do enough during streams, so I need to take it down and then like cut it up into its own kind of like reaction video. So yeah, now nah, it's not that bad, mate. I I'd hope so anyway. But yeah, I have tried as well. Like because there was um, I'm starting to try and credit more in description so hopefully like when we do like streams where i actually react to content i'll take down like the actual url and throw it into like a word document and then after the stream is done leave the stream private edit it into a video and then when the video goes out put all the links into description and go from there so yeah sniper wolf every video you know we should do what jack's film does and just do sniper wolf bingo <laughs> just we should actually just do that just rip it off like so it's not <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, you like once in a blue moon. You can just not monetize. Um, theoretically... Oh yeah, shit. Well, I mean, I technically could, but 
like not this but not the vods i i i won't monetize the vods i'd only monetize the videos because like that is fair use like me going in and cu like cutting out all the content and putting like all my commentary in doing the edits and stuff that's transformative like that's that's good that's what i view as like okay but like if this was a video and i'm just like That prime be yellow, though. What the sock doing? Like, that, you know, that's not transformative. That's just shy it, like. Um. Yeah, anyway, sorry. I actually was going to move on to the point, like, um. These prime uh, tubs, I think they're official. They look official anyway. Um, they're kind of cool. Like, uh, like they, again, they're not listed on the website, so they mightn't even be official. But they are cool that, like, um, like the idea of buying a like, tub this size for $25 and five gallons prime. I don't actually know what the conversions on that is, but let me just pull up the calculator real quick. <laughs> I can't remember what button you click for it. Length, weight, mass, weight, maybe weight, mass. Uh, where is it? Wait, it was, um, oh, okay. I've never full screened a calculator before. Um, I know, hold on, wait, you said something I know. Uh, I was going to forget there for a minute. Your reaction videos slash clips aren't so bad because you don't do it at that often. True, yeah, I do try to, like, make the like streams my own and the content my own and then obviously you guys adding in on top of it is also nice as well and you also credit i do try my best yeah like i do know the result like the video i was going to put credits into that i might have to go back to like maybe tomorrow or somewhere whenever i get around to it was the tiktok reaction video where i reacted to my for you page uh anytime i like reacted to the content I would make sure that at, like the actual watermark of the person was still in the video, at least for the start of the video. And then afterwards, I'm free to edit how I want because I still got that credit in, you know? And like, yeah, and Sniper Wolf doesn't. Like, Sniper Wolf full on, like, will actually crop out not even just the fucking watermark and credit the person, like, discredit the person either. Like, she won't credit them, should I say. She'll also, like, steal fucking even steal freebooter stuff as well and she'll also steal the joke of the original tiktok as well like just just fucking show it it's not that hard you like it's okay to like god are we actually I, we might actually get into this a little bit because the fact like both are kind of wrong like i like jack's films right he's not that bad and I do actually what kind of watch all his videos. I will confess that. Like I have subscribed to that channel. I watch all his like bingo videos because I think they're entertaining. But like it is kind of a bit weird that he keeps doing it. But I understand why he's doing it. He's doing it for good reason, and he's trying to make up for what Sniper Wolf won't do, which I think is a fair enough reason for him to do what he's doing, even if it kind of does come across as like obsessive or anything like that. But that's fine. Uh, as somebody said before, Sniper Wolf should have just called him a creep and then maybe he should have stopped. Uh, yeah, and Sniper Wolf doxed him. Like, that's the, that's what we're, this, that is the duality we are in right now. Fella literally fucking doxed her. And for what? Oh shit, sorry. Go read the calculator there for a minute. Like, why? And like, her sister is just as worse. Like, it's just, the situation's so serious. And all she tweeted towards Sully, the guy who makes fucking automo, auto, you know, automatones, the, the, the little screech jokes where you go, eh, eh, eh. I, I can't do the sound. Like, she was just like, eat my nuts. And it's like, okay, you contributed absolutely nothing, just like your sister does for the videos. Cool to know. Runs in the family. But like, how could you do that though? Like, as everybody keeps saying as well, like, there are channels, right? Like, there are literal channels for you to fucking talk to Jackson and say, hey, this isn't cool, please stop. That's not hard. Instead of maybe she fucking blocked him or something, maybe that's why. But, like, 
it just does my head in like how do you think like how do you think going up to a person's house and doxing them is a good idea? And I think people are also pointing out that she has, like, a fucking track record as well. Like, a criminal record to a certain degree. So it's just like, bro, what? So, like, you're telling me someone that was dangerous before just turns up at your house randomly and wants to talk? I agree, like, though, with Jax Films, like, not wanting to actually go out to her and fucking talk to her. That's weird. Like, as somebody said before, like, what if she just had a weapon? What if Jax Films had a weapon as well? What if she actually went to, to his front door, he had a weapon, and shot her because he thought she was being intimidating? There's so many ifs and buts with this. Like, it's so mad. And I... Oh, my God. I despise this fact as well. People are bringing up the fact that she's a fucking girl. It's like, oh, because she's a girl. Shut the fuck up! It doesn't matter. Like, like seriously. I don't care what gender it is. You're doing something fucking illegal uh, compared to somebody who's actually putting effort into the content that you're just not putting enough effort into. He's legitimately helping you, like, do the right thing, but you're just not taking that opinion. Like, I anyway, sorry, I'm getting to <laughs> I'm just letting some of this energy out because I've been holding on to it since the fucking KSI fight. Like, it's so annoying, though. I really hope she gets fucking, like, as someone says, at the very least, like, banned off Instagram. Because the fact that Instagram are keeping that up show that they don't mind people doxing each other, which is kind of weird. Um, but then again, Meta is a dying, like, company, so whatever. Like, maybe that's why. Um, and then YouTube, like, I literally, like, I tweeted this out. Actually, let me just... I legitimately tweeted this out. Where was it? Um, this one. Just click this button. Thanks, guys. See that? That's a report button. You can report her for literal harassment and that shit. Now, I'm not saying just, you know, when it brings up the video options, click all of them and say that you're the victim and all that. I'm not saying that. I'm saying, like, there is a way to report her that's, you know, obviously not just for yourself, like. Obviously, like, you're not reporting that yourself is being harassed. You're reporting that Jack's films got harassed. Like, I left a comment and told, like, what was going on. Even though, like, they only give you 300 words, which actually wasn't enough for me. I was just about to finish my sentence and finish off the, like, report, but then it's like, oh, you've reached your limits. Like, oh, cool, thanks. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. And, oh, gee, I just realized as well, this is worse as well. Like, fucking now making light of criminal behavior, like... Look at this shit, like, we show up to your house, what do you do, like, I don't know, like, honestly, whatever the person, like, you're stalking, like, probably does. And, like, the saddest part is, I think Sniper Wolf was legitimately, like, actually, like, um, what was she? Like, she was legitimately in, um, like, she had a stalker before that doxed her, and she was saying before how it wasn't cool and all that shit. And there was, the, I think there was also a streamer as well. That was just saying to her, or, like, he was just commenting on her videos before. Something about doxing and people like, oh, that's where she got the inspiration from. Like, you know, as a kind of trying to, like, put in a little funny jab into it. Because it is a fucking serious situation. You need a bit of, like, comedy to try and lighten up the thing a little bit. But, like, really hard to lighten up a doxing, like, you know. Um, But Instagram, she doxed people, us, uh, fine. Um, yeah, like, it's, it's so weird. It's like, she gets doxxed, it's not cool. She doxxes someone else, that's bad, or, yeah, that's bad. And, of course, the last little thing I'll mention as well, people have mentioned that, like, even YouTube said before, I laughed at this before, this whole thing, like, even started, like, months ago, but they were talking about, like, oh, how does Sniper Wolf get her ideas for her content? From her fans, of course, and it's like, yeah, no, she's stealing from, like, random people on the internet and making it like her quote-unquote own content no that's fucking transformative isn't it man i have so much smoke coming in for the first stream in ages we're meant to be playing dishonored and i actually might just like legit we're probably gonna end it on this prime talk soon like because i need to like go to sleep um for work tomorrow um yeah crazy bro crazy i i like again the saddest thing is though i think like everybody knows this at this point but like she won't get banned 
I almost guarantee it 100%. No, are you not? Actual bet here. Clip this if you want afterwards. I bet, like, uh, how, okay, wait, how much can I gift a sub? I'll gift one to five subs to uh, Lazy Panda's channel when she streams next. If Sniper Wolf gets banned off YouTube. If Sniper Wolf gets banned, I will gift one to five subs to Lazy Panda 53. There you go. That's how confident I am that she is not going to get banned. And even if she does, that's free money for my friends, so that's fair. <laughs> um, but yeah, crazy. I keep saying crazy. I've been saying that a lot during the trip as well. Like, I just didn't have any other response pattern. It was literally just, man, that's crazy. It's like um, when I used to say a lot, like, it is what it is, like. Um, she does thousands of monies for YouTube, and she gonna say YouTube is misogynistic if they ban her. Guarantee she'll have a fit over it, yeah. 100% she will have a fit over it. It's just mad. It's actually just insane. Ah, uh, but hey, you know what? You're just a viewer. I'm just some random guy on the internet. Yeah. It's just... It is... What it is. That's the internet. As some people have said, should have just stayed on the internet. But she had to put it on thing. And that's mad. Like, on it. <sighs> yeah, no, I feel like Jack's Films really should actually, like, file, like, a police report. Like, against her on this one. Because that's, that's just something that's, that's ass way. It's like, like, if it was me getting docs personally, I would actually do everything. Like, I, I'm not the only one that lives in this house. Like, well, even if I was living on my own, I'd still do all this shit anyway. But, like, I would 100%, like, go to the police, like, whenever I got the chance or even call them. Because that's weirdo behavior, like. God, I fucking hate Twitter sometimes. Sometimes Twitter has shit opinions, like. Because, like, legitimately people be like, oh, that's fair why, like, she doxed him. What? How? Okay. You know, let's leave it there. Let's put stop the brakes. Let's leave it there before we get, get too much more into it. But yeah, that's just Twitter being Twitter. And no, I'm not calling it fucking X. Like, um, and I have many opinions about YouTube and Twitch that they support more some uh, uh more some gender than other. Honestly, it's kind of true. Like. This, that, and the other, but again, as I said, stop the brakes. Stop it there. Let's go back to just talk about Prime and how impossible it is for me up to, to obtain because I live in fucking Ireland, like the most, like the richest country in Europe, but I don't feel like the richest man in Europe. Um, I don't know why. I kind of just want to keep like scrolling. Um, you know the girl who threw her cat over her chair and gave her cat vodka? Alinity, wasn't it? I think that's the name. Or was it someone else? Now, okay, if it's not Alinity, I want to immediately apologize and say I didn't mean that, like, thing. Okay, never mind, it was Alinity. Uh, and I'm not even going to say alleged. She literally, like, it's on recording, she did it. Um, so, she wasn't banned. Or never was. Okay, cool, deadly. That, that, that's fantastic to know that you can literally commit, like, animal abuse on stream and, like, nobody, like, on Twitch will do anything. But to be fair, Twitch is, like, Twitch is literally proven to be actually, like, um, how do I say this without getting myself banned now? <laughs> um, Twitch kind of are made of, like, a bunch of people who kind of simp over girls <laughs> that's, that's, that's the weirdest way i constructed that sentence uh but like essentially it's almost proven because anyone that talked out against some of them were legit like well even not just women obviously like some like some were also men that talked out against it but like they would be banned like something like, for doing shit like that 
Sure, I mean, Speed was like, well, okay, to be fair, Speed, like, he probably deserved his ban, like, when he got it. But he got in his account back, like, literally years later. But Twitch are probably never going to see him again, like. Um, or never was a joke. We could, should do, um, fact of, I don't know what you're trying to cut off there. <laughs> Didn't she? Yeah, legit. Um, Alex was just mentioned there that she did feed her cat alcohol. That's just disgusting, like. Um, oh, Jesus, this is well fucking hell. Um, yeah, vodka. Factor cap. Oh, factor cap. Should this Twitch streamer be banned for this? Okay, so we got here Joseph Nightflyer doing a hot tub stream. I think because he's a man and he didn't on purposely draw nipples onto his character model that he should be banned for not being sexy enough to make us money. I'm I'm digging myself something here. I need to stop. Oh, I kind of just want to watch <clears throat> this real quick. Uh, no, actually, I don't even want to watch it. I'm just going to mention it because this was fucking gas. Wakey Wines ordered some fucking Dodgers Prime from the US, and all the bottles were just emptied. But he's still selling the bottles for fucking twenty five pound. Which oh, there's the conversion literally right there. Twenty eight euro, so basically thirty euro. For an empty bottle of Prime. That's mad. We have Joe. Oh no. Oh god. So wait. What's the factor cap? Um. Oh wait. No. That is the whole thing. So let, let me rephrase it a bit. Oh. Do you get banned? Yeah. Right. Floppy. Do you want to get out of that uh, box real quick? No. I'm, oh, I'm. Twitch. That is a dark joke. I am joking. Floppy is a plushie, not an actual dog. Don't worry. Don't don't look at uh, me in my room on my channel or me in my room too. <laughs> Actually, I don't even know if they're still available. I think the advert is still only available for that. <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> cancelled. Ah. Uh. Ay 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 ay. Bro, I forgot about this as well. Oh my god, I forgot about this. We were literally in a pound land, but they weren't doing this. Okay, 100% fake. I just saw it on Facebook. Um, but imagine if that was true, though. Prime two for one. When it's like two pounds usually, or three euro. So that'd be like 150 for two of all. That's crazy. That's crazy, bro. That's absolutely crazy. Spar, though, doing it for 150. That That's... That's goat behavior. Peter got a scream over on Twitch. Peter? Peter, are you complaining again? But not gonna do shit, yeah. Peter? Peter? What the fuck? <laughs> the Prime. He got the Prime, guys. God, sorry. Just looking at all this, like, um, what do we call it? Uh, I'm just looking at all this prime stuff. Is actually just make me cry. <laughs> I'm too obsessed with this fucking drink. Like Jesus Christ, I need to actually just stop looking at it. Like, oh, that's actually so cool. Wait, Ralph's? Where's that? Oh yeah, so Tesco were getting them in as well, but they're li like they had a limit of six prime bottles. That's mad. Increase the in eBay looking for import some. Wait, oh eBay? No, I don't fucking trust eBay for shit. Like, no shot. Hold on, I need to go back up for a minute. That's actually not even that bad. Like, $2.29, so $2.50. So that's like, what, like 3 euro for Dodgers Prime. And that's not even in the stadium. Is that a Walmart? No, it's not a Walmart. It's way too small to be a Walmart, Joe, you dumbass. Ralph's. What's Ralph's? Search. 
Ralphs.com. Supermarket chain. Ralph's American Supermarket Chain, Southern California. That's cool, actually. I did it. I legit was. I kept telling everyone that like Dodgers Prime is only available in thing, but I. I mean, if it's available there as well. Yep, Dodger Prime. <laughs> Do you imagine? I don't think they would. Um, sign in to add no. Cause like. That's the thing. That's the reason I actually haven't checked if you'd send them. And honestly, I don't want to end up like Wakey Wines and have the bottles emptied like when they're getting to Ireland. Like, I, like, unironically, I would love to have the Dodgers Prime. Not even for the bottle, but for the taste. Because I love blueberry stuff. And like, blueberry Prime. Like, it's literally, it, it's calling me. It's calling my name. It's calling my name, bruh. The shop literally like 20 meters away from me have three flavors of Prime. That's epic. I bet it's like... I bet it's Tropical Punch, which is the red one. Uh, blue Raspberry, which is the blue one, obviously. And probably Ice Pop or Lemon and Lime. I bet those are the flavors. Um, Wait, hold on one second. Why am I on this? No, 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 no. We're not playing that out loud. Not that's a bad idea to play whatever I was going to play out loud, but, like, it's on YouTube and, like, it'll get copyright cl uh, claimed. Ice pop green and red or blue. Yeah, legit. Those are the four flavors that are in, like, nearly every country right now. Um, Just give me a uno momento. So if I go to drink prime, I think you said... Before. No, I don't think I see your country list. I'm not going to say it out loud in case I'm wrong anyway. Um, but like legit, if you go to the Prime website and check out all the locations, every single location has li literally those four uh, flavors every time. Um, but I do know in Ireland, we also have like Metamoon and Strawberry Watermelon, but it's not listed yet for some reason. I think, like, the website itself is a bit out of date. It's not updated, like, fast enough to keep up with the, um, the rapid rate of, like, how it keeps going. Hey, <laughs> you maybe have more, yeah. Um, I'm gonna be honest. I'm actually just gonna... Hold on. Don't know if you hear that, but... Legitimately just closing Dishonored for a minute. And I know it's a bit late to be doing this, but... And then don't worry, like, when this VOD goes to YouTube, I'm actually going to call it something else, because this was not playing Dishonored. This was the thing, like, maybe testing Prime tomorrow when my mate comes over here. Yeah, I'd say, if you don't mind me asking as well, do you remember the price? Because I want to recommend you a price range that you should be, like, paying for Prime. Because, oh, just because, like, myself, personally, I was paying, like, €4 Euro for cans when they're now, like, at little three euro like three euros ish for the hydrate bottles that's actually not that bad i think that's a okay price i haven't seen them in like lower than that myself um but the cans if you ever see them three euro 350 should be like around the price you're paying for those because like four euros what i paid when i went to a certain shop to get them when they first came over and like i got like all of them um and I got an extra one from a mate. So it was like... What was it? So it was five cans. Three, six, twelve, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. So it was eighteen euro total for six cans of Prime. And then it was an th extra three euro because I found the orange one soon after, I think. It was either orange or Nerfle. No, sorry, it was strawberry watermelon I found afterwards. So I paid 21 euro total for, like, Prime in one week. J you know, just, it like, it does add up. Like, that's the only reason I'm giving you a warning. And then just showing you there, like, how in, even in the UK, they have it for, like, two pounds for the bottles and, like, cans. So that's, like, 250 euro. Like, you know, it's a diff, like, it's very different. Um, And then there's the palettes as well. I can't remember for the life of me what website was. It? I think it began with G. Uh, no, that's Ralph's. I was looking it up earlier. Or maybe... Oh, it might actually still be on my phone. Maybe that's why I can't find it. Um, 
Just give me a minute. It was three euros, like 50 cent or 20, 50 cents. Before it was like uh, 12 euros here, like months ago. Exactly why you should not buy into them. Like, as I've mentioned before during the stream, I, I've literally seen lemonade and glowberry in a shop. But glowberry, I think, was like 15 euro. I think I've seen grape before, but I can't remember how that was. But the lemonade bottle, there was only one left and it was like 7 euro. And it's like, I'm not paying like over double the price for a bottle. Like, especially like what I went through with the cans. What I went with, through with the cans cannot be like reversed. <laughs> I'm not getting back. Let's see. So that's six cans, a euro each, six euro. I'm not getting my six euro back. I bought into it early and I really shouldn't have. I, I, I couldn't control myself. Um, uh, nah, hell nah. 13 euros for a drink, rather die. Like, I know this poor, like, kid, like, he was happy getting it. Like, he was, we were at, like, Comic-Con, and I seen this kid, like, he saw KSI Bottles of Prime, and he bought one, because, like, it's a UK exclusive. And I literally asked him, like, real quick, hey, kid, how much does that cost, like? And he's like, um, I think 15 euro, he said he paid for it, and I was like, oof, jeez. Obviously, I didn't, like, um, say that to his face or anything. I kind of just turned away, and I was like, oh, jeez. Like, that's mad. Like... I'll be fair, right? Out of all the flavors, if the Prime card flavors are different flavors and the Dodgers Prime was put in front of me, I'd be willing to go a little bit above three. Not ma not crazy, right? Like, I'm talking like 50 to 150 extra. But I would not go a lot more than that. Like, the only reason is because, like, I know and maybe... No, no, not lemonade. No, I feel like lemonade's going to spread more. But, like, those two in particular, I feel like um, I would. But that's only because um, I legitimately just don't feel like, uh, whatchamacallit, it's worth it. And then I didn't even mention Glowberry because, yeah. I'm a retailer for 60 euros. Uh, you should find, find out, like, what place don't have them yet. And then go from there, like... Um, whatchamacallit, what, what am I looking at here, hold on, sorry, one second, uh, if I go into here, go to click this button, click, uh, history, no, nope. see, this is the best part about having Opera as well, by the way, non-sponsor, but, like, if I find history, and if I go... Uh, there it is, Musgrave Marketplace. If I have a link on my phone that I want to send to my computer, I just click the flow button. Give it a few seconds. Sends. <clears throat> right. Then actually, let me just close this for a second. And then open this. Do I have anything docs worthy? Uh, not really, but there's some private stuff there, so I'm not going to show that. Um, But I do want to show... Like, on the side of the screen, if it wasn't full screen, there's, like, this, like, little arrow you can click, and it can, like, send whatever's on my phone to here and vice versa. But anyway, look at it. Prime hydration, right? And this is Musgrave Marketplace. This is up in Dublin now. And, like, as far as I'm aware, I saw, like, my mate was taking a picture of um, a pallet of these. I think it was, like, 24 bottles of these for, like, 23 euro or 25 euro, something like that. Oh, no. It, yeah, no, 23. It says case there as well. But this is the issue, right? I can't just outright buy... Okay, there's a few reasons I can't just buy this. One, because I'm not that mental. Two, because it's a pallet of Prime that I'd have to carry home. I don't even know how I'd get that onto a bus to get home. Uh, three, I'm not a company, so I can't, like, re like you know, I can't just get it. Like, when you go to login register, um, what do you call it? Would you like to set up an account? Uh, where is it? Uh, t -t 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 I swear it said somewhere. Register. Yeah, so to be a terrestrial, you need to be a registered business slash sole trader. You don't need to be VAT registered. I could go to my workplace and just say, hey, do you mind if I use our workplace as an example as thing and just set up an account? <laughs> just... 
<laughs> like honestly, I I think my workplace would actually like this idea because there's a certain section in our workplace that's kind of like shutting down. So like, if I brought this idea in that we just sell prime bottles in the back, <laughs> that'd be so gas. Imagine, oh, that'd be so funny. Like, um, but anyway. You have to provide stuff as well. That's the main reason I can't do thing. But as I mentioned at the start of the stream, my mate is going to be up there tomorrow for X reason. And he might go into one of them if it's close enough and see if they're selling them individually. Uh, because if they're selling them individually, I think he will message me and he'll be like, yo, do you want one? And I'd, I'd probably say yes, as long as the price is right, though. But the fact that they're selling cases for like 23, 25 euro for 24 of them like what that's roughly like 150 per bottle like that's good you could though make a business about jokes my fire theoretically it is because like i do have a business email but i just have to... actually wait hold on alex you're onto something wait i literally could just say look i'm this twitch streamer uh this is my business <laughs> just imagine imagine if that worked could you imagine if that worked? I don't think they'd count it because Twitch and YouTube aren't <coughs> jobs, quote unquote. But like, it'd be so funny if that worked out. I mean, people do actually go to the shops though to buy stuff in bulk. So like, it's not just like for soul tracers and businesses, I don't think. Or at least when you go in person. So then you buy so much in retail. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, Loki, <-key>, I <laughs> imagine. <laughs> <coughs> that's legit just my business now like I literally quit my job and all I do is legit just buy stuff like that you won't get into normal shops and just sell it to where I live because like I obviously for me talking like this like I don't live in Dublin that much I'll give you about my locational information but where I live I actually could do that <laughs> just we can't get glowberry where I live I live in the middle of fucking nowhere right so suddenly it's like thing imagine and again the workplace thing could actually legit work as well i might actually joke around and just say that like um but what was it as well yes yeah, so see here prime oh this is so much better to look at than my phone they do like the cans uh they do ice they do thing meta moon is actually more available than you think it is and that's it. Then the rest is literally just meat. Sorry, guys. Sorry for showing uh, Musgraves meat on stream. Like, that's kind of inappropriate, I know. Um, but, yeah. Uh, do it. You could get money and put it to streams. Like, that would actually be kind of gas, wouldn't it? Like, if I actually just quit what I was doing, just kept stalking the Musgrave, like, marketplace for, like, Prime stuff. Or even, not even just Prime. Like, let's say, um, what can you get in America you can't get here? I mean, you can kind of get these, but Pop-Tarts. Do they have... Okay, they don't actually have Pop-Tarts. They have Pop-Cards. Not... Okay, they don't. They have Pop-Thing. <laughs> How dare you show your meat. Ah. Show the meat. To make me feel complete. His dad is actually so fucking gas. Like, his dad made a whole song about I Show Speed showing his fucking dick on camera. Like, that is actually just gas. Ah, oh, man. Um, Josie, a singer. Nah. I mean, I have sung before and I've done covers, but they're unpurposely... Well, I say they're unpurposely bad, but, like, I can't sing, so they're bad. Like, when I say bad, like, they're, 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 they're bad. Um, yeah. Um, what would you do for a song? What, what do you mean, like, what would I do for a song? Do you mean, um, like, what would I sing about? Because I have a uh, fun factoid uh, that I'm going to throw in your face right now. Hmm. No. Okay, go on. But like, if someone have to do something to you to make a song. I don't know. Like, honestly, it's just kind of awkward for me to work on this computer to make a song, even though I have made demo pieces before. But like, I just never really get into doing full on proper music. Like, 
But if I were to sing a song, I don't know. Like, it's not... I, actually, no, it is a follower goal, though. But I, I need to remember to put the numbers back in their place. Because I was swapping it back from... I, I put it on Kick, and now it's back on Twitch again. Um, who should we call it? Blah, 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 blah. Um, it was to dress up as an idol and sing a song, that's it. That's what the follower goal was. Let me give you a sample of my singing that won't get us copyright claimed. I want to actually open this one and... Oh, it was it. No, that's my parody. Um... Da, 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 da. Oh yeah, I only did it like this. Um, but make a song. Again, I don't know. Like it's been, like I, I probably already mentioned it, and I probably just didn't see it because OBS was a bit slow loading it. But as I said, like. If I were to do what I'd need, like, actual, um, finance, just so I can go into a proper, like, studio and just do my bit. Because I feel like if I'm sitting in a studio and I'm time pressured by, like, the amount of time I have to actually make the song or else it'll cost more because more money will be needed to rent out a studio. Like, then I'd actually proper make the song and, like, try to remember in my head all the music theory and all the music stuff in the program that I'm meant to use to do what I need to do to actually create the song. Because what I'm showing here, right? Like, this is, like, what happened. Yeah, so welcome to my first attempt to make music for you or for your lovely ears to hear. This is part of my assignment to make a pop song during the second semester of college. It was going well till I had to rush it and add my awful vocals to it, but don't worry, instrumental coming soon. I should just get Hatsune Miku to sing this. That'd be gas. Because <laughs> I've done that before. I got Hatsune Miku to sing um, The Path to Her Savior. Um, if you would lose a bet, would you make a song? Maybe, yeah. But even then, like, I still kind of, like... I have, like, there is another Sherry Albert story demo piece I need to make. Um, but I'm not going to mention, like, what its title is or what its theming is yet. But there's at least one more Sherry Albert story demo OST piece coming. Uh, but again, it doesn't require my vocals. I've tried adding vocals to another thing before that I was making, like, a song kind of thing. But it didn't really sound right, to be honest. Like, I just couldn't make it click, like. And, like... The thing as well with making a song is you need to give me a lot of time with it. Like, to be fair, with this, it was because of college, but it took me 12 weeks to get this song from, or f make this song from start to finish. And it required, like, a lecture to be, like, constantly, well, not con well, yeah, no, constantly listening to it to give me feedback on the song as I was creating it. I've actually got to shut up for a minute, like I'm ruining it. But you're gonna hear just how horrible the vocals are, like. But I tried, honestly, I tried. I'm gonna let, like, the first course of, or verse and thing play out. I remember a time in my mind Thinking of all the ways I've cried Did I feel it? Where am I going? Is music any good? I can stop overthinking it What has happened in the past should just stay in And I actually like this part coming up here, like... Listen, listen, listen. Oh, it's good.
Like, that part where I say then lines up so well with the fucking instrumental. I love that, man. And, like, the funniest part is, when I sang that part of the song, I literally just copied and pasted it, I think, over to somewhere here as well. So, like, it just lines up t the same time twice, but at the end it doesn't line up right, I don't think. Hold on. Hey, in the past, dead time to think of them. I don't know what it, like, I did there to cause it to work. It just... It just works. I don't know if I'm going, like, if I've just been crazy this whole time, but, like, it, it's just, that's the, like, literal only part of my vocals I actually, like, adore. And then, obviously, the bridge is fine because it's meant to be me talking. It's not meant to be me singing. Um, But, yeah. You were being delulu. <laughs> Delusional. Yeah. Like, maybe I'm being delusional. Uh, I did do like a remake of this for its second anniversary, but that's god, that's even worse. Like, and I used multiple vocals for it as well. I think. Where is it? Yeah. So le legit, this part is literally just me talking. Now this is delusional, whatever the fuck I'm talking about here, like. To me, to you, to all of us? Well, we all have our different views, but in the end of it all... Okay, kind of does align a little bit there, but... Time to think of now is so daunting Time to think beyond will happen soon Time as we know is gone when we notice so funny to think like that exact instrumental is literally used in the first OST piece for Sherry Arbor story like if you listen to the intro of it's time to think obviously it's written there Sherry Arbor story version but like it's mad to think like they're the same like uh, oh yeah I made a Minecraft parody of it's time to think as well No, it's, where is it? I have to keep searching everything to give myself more, like, searches. <laughs> Look at that. And, like, even, like, official Minecraft thing. And I even did a whole thing for it as well. To be fair, that was actually kind of gas to try and put together, like, um, whatchamacallit. That was during, like, the Minecraft series. And then during the Minecraft series, I also sang... PewDiePie song, but th this is now an example of me doing a cover. This is how, like, oh god, and it is fine to play this music on stream. I'm pretty sure because it's not claimed. Yeah, see, it's not claimed. This one goes out to all my gamers out there. We've all been there. You know this feeling. Oh, Old model, by the way, as well. <laughs> I wake up early in the morning, make a gas weed. Ah. It's like I'm in the nether cause I can't sleep. Frick. In case you got amnesia, man, I want that blue stuff. Oh. I got my iron pick. pick there is, um, whatchamacallit. There is, uh, the congratulations song. The instrumental isn't actually his, so, like, that one is copyright claimable. That's the only one I know that was copyright claimable, so, yeah. Because you want to make C, or... What? Yeah, people make cool stuff, yeah. Yeah. 
And I remember as well, oh my, like I do this for a lot of the songs that I cover as well. Like I'll upload the vocals for it. So, so like back then when I was uploading the song and the vocals, like they'd be, you know, both be on the same channel, but now they're all like different channels and stuff. So yeah. Hey, I'm not SPD. How's it going? A WW stream. I know. I, I, I swear I'm not turning into fucking Sniper Wolf as we're streaming. Like, but I'm just like, um, we just kept talking and we got to this point, like of me just doing thing. He's not SPD. SPD. What's that? Is that like, um, well, it's your, well yeah, to be fair, it is. Well, this is now my content, except maybe for the thumbnail that's going to show. But yeah. Where is it? This one goes out to all my gamers out there. It's so weird without all the music, there. like. You know this feeling. Wait, SPD. Did I? Oh, did I say something different? SPD. Joe, literally, your blinder memory is goldfish. Oh, yeah, your fucking name is not thing. So, like, you're blue. There you go. You're blue now. <laughs> For fuck's sake, yeah. No, it, it's fucking like my eyesight is not twenty twenty anymore. There's a tooth in my fucking head that's falling apart. Like my memory is not as good as it used to be. I'm actually falling apart at the age of twenty three. Like that is crazy. Um, sorry. Let me just play a little bit more of this. <laughs> I wake up early in the morning, make a gas weep. Ah. It's like I'm in the nether cause I can't sleep. Frick. In case you got amnesia, man, I want that blue stuff. Oh, I got my iron pick pick with a fortune buff. I'm my... what a baby cause that's where it's found. I'm so freaking Loki that I'm underground. Uh, but I don't forget the name in one second. <laughs> like, I don't, I thought, like... I don't know what I, I was literally just looking at the end of the name like that's why I kept like um doing thing like I was tunnel visioned like I have shit memory and vision I am I am shit now <laughs> it's just but hey you know what at least I'm not sniper wolf we can take that W today dab I didn't actually properly dab there but I did do dab like during uh, the fucking chaos I fight <laughs> Because my mate was unironically, like, not unironically doing it, but it was just doing it funnily, like, just as a joke, like, and I was like, yeah. I don't know. We were just were. Other than this, like, this is, like, the only other piece that I've made recently that I really like. Like, as you can probably tell from, um, It's Time to Mine, it's kind of, like, it's got a bit of, like, a rock element to it. That's why, like, this one's very, I think. <laughs> Dabbing, D-A-B-B, -B. just to correct you real quick. Sorry, I, I'm just being a uh, grammar dunce. <laughs> P -P. I said B-B, unless I said P-P by accident, like. And like, what's also very common with like my music as well is I'm actually a bit lazy because I literally pull like bits from anything else I've made before and I use it in newer stuff. Like the "It's Time to Think" is in Sherry Arbor's story, and like this is literally from uh, "Stare of the Psychopath," and I just made it into a whole new thing. Like. And this isn't even what this part was meant to be like, but I kind of liked it better for what I, instead of what I was going for. Like, see, and this is what I meant about reusing parts of songs. This is literally the fucking intro to "It's Time to Think," but it works with the theming of this. Like, oh wait, you just. I just realized you made me actually say it like I probably didn't even say it but you made me say it by correcting myself like fuck's sake like 
I love this part. Like, that effect is so easy to do. All you do is cut out some instrumentals, and it just makes it sound so different. Wait for it. XD. You know I'm gonna do shit post about it. <laughs> You're free to do so. I don't mind. It's all fun and games until we dox each other. Oh yeet. Ah, oh, man. Even if I wouldn't, I still do a <laughs> joke, by the way. Yeah, I, I don't worry. I know you're... Well, actually, you do have to say that just in case somebody else thinks you're actually going to, like... And I'm joking, yes, as well. Because even if I put on the sarcastic voice, somebody mightn't even understand that I'm being sarcastic. Not everybody can be... Uh, not everybody can read the emotions the same way. I need to fucking update this. I haven't updated... This is meant to be like an interactive game kind of thing, but I haven't actually updated it, like... If you would say thing, I wouldn't. Yeah, see, I literally skipped over saying it just in case. <coughs> oh, let me see where the, how far this goes. Hello, everyone. Welcome to this little game. All right, while we click, and we got volume one blurb. The first tag, more options, and characters. I think characters would have more. Welcome back. Now, let's see. So we got Sh Sherry Aubrey. I love that title so much. It sounds so stupid. Like Sherry Aubrey in Sherry Aubrey's story. I think she's like the main character. I'm not too certain though. Samantha Aubrey's concept art. Because I think I mentioned in that video more about her. I don't. Did I do a summary separate? I can't remember. Maybe I linked the wrong video, to be honest. Uh, Lila and Joe's Night Flyer. And obviously, that's not me, Joe's Night Flyer. Like, that's this guy, Joe's Night Flyer. He, he different, definitely. Um, It used to be more of a self-insert, but nowadays it's a lot different, especially with what I've written about the character. Like, it, it's, it's crazy, like, how... Well, okay, there are some things that are very obviously changed that's not linked directly to me, but, like, he, he, who, he, he built different. He do be different. Hello, everyone. Welcome back. Ah, yeah, okay, I forgot. That just leads straight to the video. Oh, yeah, no, they all lead to the videos, then, because those are, oh, yeah, see, I need to update this with, like, a more characters option. So I can show the other three characters. Why isn't Claire here? Why didn't I link Claire first? Because it was Sherry, Claire, Lila, Joseph and Flair. I'm missing a character. Oh yeah, uh, Samantha. No. Sorry, Psychopath and then Samantha. But yeah. Um, let me go back. But yeah, that interactable game, I'm actually going to write that up as a thing I need to do. But obviously not yet. Sass. Interact. Updates. And like, can we actually just real quick just look at the date on that? Hello? When did I last, like, six months ago? 16th of April, that's crazy. It's been half a year. I need to update that soon. That's half a year's of content that I haven't done thing. That's like an odd video I uploaded to TikTok. Uh, may you say the letter I. Okay, you got me for a little bit. What are you going to try and spell out here? I bet you can't spell I cup. <laughs> I 
Um, <laughs> what was I gonna do first? Um, hold on, wait. What? Uh, shit. Uh, clips. Because I know I need to see the clips before I go as well. Um, but, 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 but. I love that, like, the first... Oh, yeah, because I featured it, that's why. Around the world, around the world. I don't trust that. Wait. Hmm. That means... Like, it's not in a different language, is it? Because, like, that's literally just... I can't remember. I'm, I'm scared. <laughs> I don't know what you're making me say. I know it's probably not egregious, but I'm still scared. Like, I don't know if I want to walk into it. Um, Let me find this clip before I walk into it. Wait, where is it? Oh, show all. No homo sapiens. I should have just left. Why didn't I, why did I have to? I kind of just lay off a bit. Top 24 hours. Top 7 days. What the fuck? Where is it? Manage clips. Oh yeah, there it is. Share portrait version of clips directly to TikTok. You can now all oh, convert your clips to portrait mode. Share them directly. Man, finally. I actually I have a reason now to upload to TikTok again. <laughs> no way. I'm legit. No, no shit. I'm actually going to like actually just fucking. Okay, I'm going to write the whole thing right now. Twitch. Clips. TikTok. This is how lazy they are. I haven't uploaded to TikTok in like probably years, but the fact that like there's an actual thing I could just click a button and it uploads it straight to fucking TikTok. I want to just see. Hold on. Um, it wasn't that one. Oh no, do they not have? Oh, they don't have them anymore. Oh, they used to. I have to remake them. Oh. 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 Sorry, I'm tired. <laughs> right, hold on. Uh, I'm going to watch this one first. I'll watch the other one and then we'll go from there. Did you take three clips? Oh, it might, it might have been just accidental. That's fine. <clears throat> I am I am shit now. <laughs> it's just... But hey, you know what? At least I'm not Sniper Wolf. We can take that W today. Dab. Oh, thank you for leaving that part in, by the way. I can put that in the tags. I did do dab, like, during uh, the fucking KSI fight. Because <laughs> my mate was unironically, like, not unironically doing it, but it was just doing it funnily, like, just as a joke, like, and I was like, yeah. I don't know. Oh. It would just work. Other than this, like, this is, like, the only other piece that I've made recently that I really like. Like, as you can probably tell from, um, it's time to mine, it's kind of, like, it's got a bit of like a rock element to it. That's why I like this one's very I think. <laughs> Dabbing, D A B B. Just to correct you real quick. Sorry, I I'm just being a uh, grammar dunce. Where, where, where's the peepee? -pee? No peepee. -pee? I have to actually refresh this just to... Oh, I never even watched the new Spy Family episode. But then again, I never actually did thing either. You're making my life easier. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm giving you more opportunities to actually, like, clip it, like, at this point. Okay, there's I, and then no homo sapiens. Around the world, around the world. Okay, wait, we're in the power here. Oh, shit. Sick. Uh, at least I paused it for a second. Um, Let me find this clip before I walk into it. Wait, where is... Oh, 
show all. No homo sapiens. No. <laughs> right. Enjoy making your um, shit post. Because I'm going to go. I'm, I'm not even just tired. I should have probably left like half an hour ago. Um, yeah. Anyway. Um, wow, I waffled nearly for two hours. Just not even playing Dishonored. Basically just clickbaited everyone into thinking it's a thing. Um, what does BT mean? I, I, you know I'm like stupid. Like you actually have to explain everything. By the way, look at Discord DM soon. I will, yeah. Um, and if you want as well, make sure to post it in the chat or the what was it general? No memes, median memes. There you go. Because if you post in that, I will guarantee you watch it. Right. Anyway, I'm gonna go. Adios. Uh, I see is on. Wednesday? No, probably Thursday. It might be Wednesday or Thursday because I am busy again this weekend and it's not a holiday. Um, So I'll be gone Friday to Sunday. I don't know if I'll be taking the next Monday off. I haven't decided that yet. I might just ask at work tomorrow. <laughs> Even though it's literally just like, I literally just took today off, like, off work because I came home from Manchester. But like, God, yeah, that imagine just they're like okay why don't you just like move your hours at this point if you're always going to be vacant on a monday like um but yeah anyway sorry uh i'm going probably be streaming if i don't stream then after that like i should be free enough well honest oh yeah wait hold on sorry i need to just double check this I actually no it isn't yeah no okay never mind i was going to say after this weekend's bank holiday but it's not but after that definitely will have a stream 26 onwards because there's still like the Halloween follower goals and stuff to complete or not even complete but to get started on like I, I actually I'll just show this real quick a little teaser um to hit 145 again which we call it uh buh, 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 buh. I know I'm meant to be going I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry then there's another image I want to show in a second. There it is. This is the new 105th uh, teaser for, or 105th follow goal teaser. It was nice talking, see ya. See ya, Alex. But yeah, that's the teaser. That's the Halloween uh, costume. Uh, don't mind that. <laughs> um, <laughs> what should we call it? There's the band. There's uh, Pussio. Uh, took some inspiration from that to make a new Sherry image. I thought this actually turned out pretty cool because I made it like shine a bit more uh, mommy. And yeah, that's it. All right. Uh, see ya.